वेलकम टू प्रणव क्षेत्र सो टुडे वी वांट टू कवर व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इन द किचन जनरली ओके दैट्स आवर किचन सो वील गो देयर एंड सी वन एट अ टाइम थैंक यू सतगुरु सो इट्स अ लिटिल शाबी राइट नाउ बट आई जस्ट शो यू व्हाट्स ऑन द स्टोव फर्स्ट ओके ओके दिस इज द राइस we just uh, let the rice uh, in the ganji ferment overnight so it becomes highly positive pranic the next morning okay so that's one thing this is the uh, sabji that got left over from last night right we use bio salt so this doesn't go bad the prana retains that's the biggest part and this is the ganji from yesterday that is fully fermented and uh, readily available for us to consume in the morning okay and what do we have here is yes. these are the vegetables for today uh since we are not uh, ready to you know uh, grow our own vegetables yet because of a few situations uh we have to buy them from the markets so what we do is we soak the vegetables in water and we use uh, something called bioenzyme we just add a little bit of bioenzyme in it so whatever chemicals or other residues that are there it will get cleaned right and then what else we have so this is the green gram we soaked overnight so because of the green gram harvest recently we were able to consume green gram every day in a very healthy and positive manner so what we do is uh, we use the whole moong or whole green gram overnight uh, we soak it uh, for 6 to 8 hours and then we just cook it or boil it let's say right. and this is the rice we soaked for today so we have the ganji rice and we have the regular rice also and this is pramodana specialty he soaked some uh, red navara rice he wants to make some paisam and this is uh, kushwantana's uh, sprouts so he just is just sprouting some separately because he would like to consume it uh, as sprouts as opposed to um dal okay and what do we have on this side so here we have uh, just a steel vessel with water and uh, jeevarasam in it and uh, this is the moon charged and sun charged water okay. and here we have the two hot packs uh, one is for the rice and one is for the curry so what we do is we cook the rice for about 70% and we leave it here okay and we just pack it fully right it's full of clothes and uh, uh, paddy hay and same thing with this one full of uh, cotton clothes and paddy hay we can cover it with that one so this way we can save a lot of uh, gas like lpg gas and also the rice will turn out very delicious actually it cooks very well after we leave it here for half an hour to 40 minutes we just uh, extract the ganji separate the ganji and we consume the rice and uh, this is our vegetable storage and a fruit storage for now and uh, this is where we collect all the organic waste and uh, we throw uh, we offer it straight to the garden Uh, we actually let it ferment uh, with uh, rice fermented water and uh, so that it will be it can decompose easily in the soil and down below we have our fermentary uh, so this is all uh, thanks to mamta akka she made all these uh, bioenzyme available for full year actually during that little period she stayed here so thanks to her and uh, this is our ganji that we are storing and these two are bio salt so we used to kanji use to make bio before the tomato period we got a lot of tomatoes and we are preserving tomatoes so in this one and that one so during our uh, expensive tomato period we used the fermented tomato um again positive pranic highly positive pranic uh so here we are boiling rice as you can see little foam comes as soon as you put the uh, rice starts to uh, as soon as you put the rice in the boiling water so we'll be removing that foam okay it's a first foam right happens within the 5 minutes of uh, you putting rice in the boiling water okay this is a little um little toxic in nature even if you don't do it it's okay but removing the ganji is a very important aspect um and then you actually let the ganji ferment for it one day and drink it the next morning that way it becomes satvik but if you drink it 2 to 2 uh, to 3 days later uh it becomes negative pranic again when i say negative pranic it's not conducive for the style of uh, our lifestyle 
right? The kind of practices we are uh, doing and uh, the kind of lifestyle we want to live in, right? For different kinds of people, different kinds of practices, it could be conducive. And uh, likewise, I've done the same thing with the green gram here. Okay, it's, you can barely see what's happening. But anyway, so I've removed the foam here as well. Okay, so rice is about 70% cooked. So we are going to turn off the stove. And we are going to transfer it to our hot pack. So I'll keep this inside. It's covered with cloth from all the four sides. And we'll cover this up properly. So that it's insulated from all the six directions.